currently April 1st, uh, 5 a.m., 5.08, and I am on my way to the airport. I think it's too bloody early, but apparently the people of Seoul don't. It's too many cars to be going around at this time. Trunk jump, I think. I'm now at Hongik University. I'm gonna board the 528 train to the Incheon Airport. I'll tell you where I'm going. Actually, no, that's pointless. Um, I'm going to Shanghai. I have to go that way. I have to walk all the way there and then go that way. Ah. Three, two, one, cheese. Oh, wait, hold on, hold on. Three, two, one, cheese. Great. Checked in. These are the people that I'm going to Shanghai with. And I'll, I'll, well, her too. So taking the photograph here. Yes. Yes. After those guys pass, or that's way too many photographs. Yes, we got. It's now 40 minutes past here. Oh. The fastest seatbelt sign has been turned on. Please remain in your seats and fasten your seatbelts. Oh, I hate this part of the flight. <laughs> she loves it. I don't like it. getting off this airplane. Um, it is now 11.43 Korean time or 10.43 Chinese time. <laughs> I'm not sure if that's sea fog or pollution. I'm gonna go with sea fog in hopes that, that that's not actually pollution. The airport looks gigantic though. Zoba. Literally, Zoba? let's walk. Meaning, let's go. Yeah. Go <laughs> That's the holy grown woman on the trolley. Think of it as a filming exercise. <laughs> the lunch by 1.30. So, just to let you know. Okay. We are officially in Shanghai. It is so, so, so when you guys have time, to just gather around in your groups and think about what to put in the PPT. <laughs> oh, yes. Oh, very nice. You're getting off to a very good start, people. <laughs> Lunch was great. We are two minutes behind schedule, and now I've got six people just smiling at me. I'm at that roundabout. Uh, I'm at that roundabout place that I saw on Google Maps once, and was really excited about. 
Here's here's the Shanghai balls. I don't know what these are called. Uh -huh. so I'm just gonna call them balls. That yeah, that uh, and there's one. Oriental Tower. There's there's the other ball. Uh, there's a, there's the other ball there. Oriental Tower, she says. So yes, I'm in Shanghai officially. Yay, we're in Shanghai. Absolutely. There's so many people here. Transparent Observatory. Yeah? Wait, why is there winds? Why is there winds? If you're scared of heights, don't look down. <laughs> well, that was fun, but we're on a really, really tight schedule, so we're we're running off to some place. I think we're going to the Shanghai Museum. We just finished the Transparent Observatory, now we're heading downstairs. There's a mirror on the ceiling of the elevator. Okay, the time is now 4.20. <laughs> constantly. We're at the Shanghai Museum now. And uh, we don't have a lot of time. <laughs> We're gonna. We have about how many time? How much do I have? How much time do we have? Like. Like 30. <laughs> We have about 30 minutes to cover four floors, so we're not gonna do that. We're just gonna focus on one floor. I think I'm gonna run around the third floor, which covers Chinese calligraphy. So it's a really rapid vlog because we don't have a lot of time to do a lot of stuff. And yeah, I'll see you guys inside. See, I don't know much about calligraphy. This looks like messy work. It's from the Ming Dynasty. While this, that looks like someone measured out a ruler. This is from, also from the Ming Dynasty, just different writers. Part of the awesomeness that is, <laughs> you guys know, see, now everyone on the bus is getting a little bit tired of me vlogging. Um, so we're going to the Consulate General of Shanghai's house for dinner. We're going to the Consulate General's office first, uh, but then we're going to his private residence for dinner, who used to be, or still is, a USC GSIS professor, so Graduate School of International Studies. and. Um, yeah, he's just a very awesome guy. Or, well, actually, I actually haven't met him, but he sounds like a very awesome guy. So, uh, yeah. This is officially the most posh residence that I've ever been in. It's like got its own driveway with security cameras, a walkway, a freaking pond right there, a map of the place, a playground. Okay, now we're going on a cruise around Shanghai. Uh, this is a ticket. I don't know the official name for this, nor can I pronounce it. Yes, well, she said it proper and she's actually Chinese. She says, oh wow, this is weird. So many, so many stuff to see. So many lights. Oh my god, look at that. What are we doing? Still April 1st, it is now 11.15 p.m. The room that I'm staying is rather nice. There's two beds, really high ceilings, lots of posh interior, nice lighting. The view I can't say is the greatest, but I mean, the view is alright. 
considering that you know this really cheap accommodation or like the school's paying for a lot of this uh, so yeah really jam-packed day um, haven't really slept or rested aside from like the 30 minute bus power nap sessions and uh, yeah that's a very productive April Fool's it might be the most productive April Fool's I've had in my life I'll see you guys tomorrow